All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are about to play Lone Echo 2. It's a demo. It's a deadly demo. A deadly demo of death. We played the first game. Nice, simple interface. Make it happen. Now arriving, Chiron Station, wow. Central Transit Hub. Wow, straight away. Jack, when you're ready, let me know. Oh, that's the old, um, okay, how do I do this? Uh, signal? I don't remember! No objective at this time. Definitely a way to do this. I've forgotten how. Yes, Jack? Whoa! <laughs> Hello. Personal space, Jack. <laughs> oh, man. That's a little bit... That's a little bit wrong. Going somewhere? It's fine. Hello. I'm ready. How do I tell you? I'm ready. Excellent. Come on, Jack. Let's have a look around, see what we can find. All right, well, the game audio is good. Welcome, welcome to Chiron's station. Today's date is 24 April 2537. Nobody home. Much like the rest of the station, at least so far. What is this? Us denied. A monument? A memorial. Dedicated to all those we have lost. Devoted to all those we have yet to save. Warning environmental systems compromised. Oxygen reserves 62%. Life supports out here too. We still have time. We'll find a stable environment. Don't worry. Who's worried? Chiron Station. Dedicated 10th of March, 2483. Lux hominum vita. Light of the life of mankind. are all closed. A miracle they managed to get the Hab Adrian and not the end. It is quality. No, I'm a second bit. Transportation 2, manufacturing, is currently unavailable. In case of an emergency, contact the station's directory. I've been touched in ages. There's an emblem here. The Polaris Initiative. We ought to keep going. I'm going up. Jack? Up here. Tell me what that looks like to you. It appears to be an old Atlas transport. And what do you suppose a ship from our time is doing here? I brought it here. Central? Hello, Captain Rat. I'm glad to see you're still safe. You too, I go on. Central. Are you saying this is your ship? That's a complicated question. The ship is my home, but it doesn't belong to me. What about life support? Does the ship still have atmosphere? The ship is currently suffering the same power disruptions as the station. However, if someone were to re-engage the ship's backup generators... Then we'd have life support. In theory. How do we get on board? The docking platform is in the next sector. Through the security checkpoint. I can show you the way. This way. Whoa! What? I <laughs> somehow hanging on to her. The door's sealed. Give me a moment <laughs> to bypass the security constraints. Oh, no. What? Hang on. What? 
<laughs> Never thought I'd see an Atlas ship out the window again. Oops. I'd say it was strange, but after everything else we've been through, a wayward Atlas ship hardly seems to qualify. Looks like we've got another door on the blink. Let's get a closer look. Can you see anything? Liv, there's something moving on the other side of the door. Some sort of creature. Let me guess. Small, spongy, and covered in tentacles. What is that? That is a tick. Sorry, you're gonna have to do a bit better than that. Ticks are an evolved form of the biomass. Oh my god, that's horrible. Jesus, that's fucking nasty. How do you mean, evolved? Accelerated evolutionary growth is an inherent physiological trait in all biomass forms. It's one of the main reasons the biomass is so... resilient. Why does it keep... following me like that? Ticks instinctually seek out the closest viable energy source, which, in this case, happens to be you. Oh, lovely. All right, so now what do we do? The only way we can proceed is by removing those ticks. Well, let's have a look around then. Looks like There's got to be some way to get rid of these things. God, so these nasty. things are disgusting. All right, we're going to try and blast them out of the door or something. It'd be easier to see without this thing trying to eat my face. There isn't any way to get this door open. So long as that tick is leeching its power, the door is inoperable. See anything useful? What about that disposal unit? That might work. You'll just need to find a way to get them into the chute. It will be dangerous, but I don't see any other option. You'll need to clear the area before boarding the ship. How the hell are we supposed to clear the room if we can't even get inside? There might be another way inside. Based on my limited knowledge of the facility's layout, there seems to be a less direct route through the loading bay. It's just this way. Particularly nice, isn't it? I like the game. Something really dark in there. Are you sure it's safe? Oh no, Captain. I think there's a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding. I never intended for you to go this way. I will assist your echo unit in clearing the docking terminal. You will need to wait here until. Uh, no, absolutely not. Captain, the area ahead is teeming with biomass. See for yourself. All right, let's have a look. Jack. See if we can use your headlamp to get some light in there. Yep, biomass. Central's right. I'm seeing a considerable biomass presence on the other side. So that's that then. Oh, wait, what do you mean, that's that? I'm sorry, Captain, but I cannot allow you to proceed. The risk is far too great. Well, if it's too risky for me, it's too risky for Jack. This isn't the Kronos 2. If something were to happen to him, he can't just reboot. Liv, I'll be careful. You don't get it, Jack. If you shut down, that's it. You're gone. Actually, I have an idea for how he might be able to avoid that possibility. Yeah, he can avoid it by not going. My knowledge of the station indicates there is a working fabricator in the adjacent section. If Jack and I can get it powered on, we can use it to scan his architecture into the station's database. So, you're saying he'd be able to reboot again? Exactly. I don't know, Jack. 
You really think this is a good idea? Not especially. But that's never really stopped us before. All right. Well, that's kind of hard to argue with. Okay. I'll try and keep the ticks distracted from this side of the window. Okay. And Jack? I know. Be careful. Don't die. Goodbye, Amanda. I'll unlock the door for you. Thanks. Ready when you are. How do I get inside? You need to go through the maintenance ducts. There should be an access hatch nearby. You're sure all the biomass in this sector is dormant? As sure as it can be. Of course, that will change once we get emergency power back online. But by then he'll be able to reboot, right? It will take a minute or two to get Jack scanned into the system, but that is more or less correct. They're claustrophobic in here with all this biomass. Ah, there you are. This control panel will restore emergency power to the local grid. That's it. Emergency power restored. The door to the loading bay is unlocked. What about the fabricator? Online and ready to scan. Jack, if you'll follow me. Just climb inside and we'll begin. This will only take a few moments. New template created. Echo unit, series 11. Initializing fixed tomographic scan. Mapping target composition. Replicating internal functionality. Linking neural matrix to network. Scan complete. Did it work? Scan output shows no errors. Neural connection is green. Yes, it worked. You're sure? From this point forward, if Jack's shell becomes damaged or destroyed, he will automatically reprint at the nearest working fabricator. Well, Jack? How do you feel? Pretty good. This should make removing those sticks much easier. That's it? Isn't that the reason we were doing this? You know what? Forget it. I'm just... glad you're okay. We're all done here. Jack, I've reopened the access hatch. Make your way back through the maintenance duct. I'll be waiting for you by the entrance to the loading bay. On my way. Be careful. Restoring emergency power has reawakened the biomass. So unless you're planning to test your new reboot ability, I would avoid all contact. Understood. I feel like that card would be used for something. Just great. Friendly, friendly biomass. Well done, Jack. I hope that wasn't too distressing an experience for you. Nothing I haven't been through before. Now then. This corridor will take us through the loading bay and back around to the rear entrance of the security room. After you, Jack. Communications may Super get a smooth. little spotty in the loading bay itself, but they should clear up once we reach the other side. Keep the channel open anyway. Spotty comms are better than no comms at all. Agreed. Good luck in there. Okay. What can we do?
These things are so evil. I love that design. The way ahead is through this door. But if you try to open it now, the tick is sure to attack you. We should find a way to pass it before we even attempt opening the door. Central, what is this panel in the floor? An electrical bypass. It allows you to push emergency power to various components in the area. You can use your cutter to gain access. Ah, clever. That should keep the tank occupied. Now we should be able to safely open the door. We're fortunate the store has an emergency release. Not all of them do. Is this overhead crane mobile? I believe so, yes. But it won't run autonomously. If you want to move it, you'll have to do so manually. When powered, the crane utilizes a zero-point energy field to carry and sort incoming cargo. Okay. Well. How do I access the emergency release? You'll that need that? to cut off the bolts holding the panel in place. Now just pull the release handle and the door will unlatch. That's it. You should be able to slide the door open. Cool mechanic. Watch yourself. There are two more ticks at the end of the corridor. Take is active. You might come in handy, buddy. It's a bit disturbing. Of my own body. How were we routed? The transformer on the wall is now live. The tick is still focused on the door. So long as the tick has a power source to feed on, it won't bother searching for another. This is really creepy. Oh, 
ourselves along. Just going along here anyway. Might not have, I don't know the way, but we'll, we'll try it anyway. So far, I'm really liking it. All right. We'll try skipping to the next section, as they say. What's that? Okay. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here, but I might want to swap something a little different. So I think we're going to do that. Switch it to something else. That's enough of a flare of that anyway. Sweet. Try placing something else now for a little bit. Cool.